Grade 4 math number 95. Classify triangles. An angle can be a right angle, an acute angle, or an obtuse angle. And a triangle can be a right angle, acute triangle, or obtuse triangle. Okay? A right triangle has one right angle. See? Right here. It's like a square. See it? An acute triangle has three acute cute little angles. Three little angles, okay? An obtuse triangle has one big obtuse angle. It can't have two. If it had two obtuse angles, it wouldn't close and it wouldn't be a triangle. It can only have one. Try to draw one. I bet you can't. It's got to only have one obtuse angle, okay? A triangle is a polygon with three sides and three angles. We can name a triangle by the vertices of its angles. One vertex is one. Two or more, we call them vertices. Okay? It's the corners there. When we label or name a triangle, we use three letters of the alphabet in order, like ABC, or BCD, or CDE, PQR. We put a little triangle before the letters to identify that it's a triangle and not just an open angle. Angle ABC is written with a little angle sign in front of it, see? Triangle ABC is written with a little triangle in front of it. That way we don't confuse one for the other. You have to put the little angle sign or the little triangle sign in front of the letters, okay? Right triangles, just like right angles, may be drawn with a little box in the corner to show it's a right angle. They have this little box there. You'll see it in your books and stuff. A rectangle or a square can be divided into two right triangles. If we draw a line from one vertex across it to the other vertex, it'll create two right triangles. Now, because the square has four sides that are equal, if we draw another line from the other vertex to the other vertex, we can divide it into four right triangles. See them? In the center there? It won't work with the rectangle because the rectangle doesn't have four equal sides. It's only got two sides that are equal, and then these two sides are equal, it would have to have four equal sides to be able to make the four right angles in the center there. Can you tell which doesn't belong? Can you look at these triangles and figure out which one doesn't belong? Like the Sesame Street song, one of these things doesn't belong here. One of these things. Can you tell? So look at them very carefully. Three of them are alike and one is different. Well, if you said this has got an obtuse angle, this has got an obtuse angle, and this has got an obtuse angle, you're right. And this one doesn't belong because it's got three acute angles. These are three obtuse triangles, and that's an acute triangle. See? All right, so now you know the difference between a right triangle, an acute triangle, and an obtuse triangle. And you know to put the little triangle symbol in front of the letters when you label it, and you know that the little box means that it's a right triangle. And we're going to talk about parallel lines next. Keep working, keep up the good work, keep trying, and I'll see you next video. Bye.